A great afternoon to all viewers of TV Escuela, DepEd, Davo de Oro. To our dear learners, most especially to our grade 8 TLE students. I am teacher Samantha Daniel Cruda from Nabunturan National Comprehensive High School, Nabunturan West District. I will be your teacher in TLE 8 Beauty Care Services, which focuses on nail care exploratory subject. Before we formally start our lesson, please prepare the following paper or activity notebook, ballpen, and module in TLE 8 Beauty Care Nail Care Services. Students, are you ready? Great! At the end of this lesson, you should be able to first enumerate ways in keeping the tools and equipment safe and functional. Second, observe proper way in keeping workplace clean and safe. Third, perform cleaning tools and equipment according to standard procedure. I want you to recall your topic in module one. Can you still remember it? Very good. At this moment, I want you to identify the following tools and equipment. Can you identify them? Let us check if your answers are correct. Nail cutter, manicure tray, nail file, hand spa machine, cuticle nipper, nail brush, Foot spa machine, foot file, sterilizer, and orange wood stick. How many correct answers did you get? Impressive! Those are the different paraphernalia in performing our task in nail care. Now the question is, how are we going to take good care of our equipment? How are we going to maintain the cleanliness and our safety after each task? Do you have an idea? Great! This afternoon, we are going to learn on how to perform the basic, preventive, and corrective maintenance in each tools. But before that, kindly open your module on page 19. In your first module, you have learned the different tools and equipment which help you to perform your task. These tools are very common because it is used by your mother or sister at home. Now, why do we need to keep our paraphernalia clean? Very good! It is vital to clean and sterilize metal equipment, wooden tools, hand and foot spa machine, as well as the environment surfaces 
before and after each use to prevent infectious disease from coming in. What would happen if our tools are contaminated? Excellent! Contamination can cause bacterial and fungal infections that are unsightly, painful, and sometimes fatal. Then, how are we going to keep our tools and equipment safe, clean, and functional? I know you have something in your mind. Let us find out if your ideas are correct. There are five ways to keep our tools safe and functional. First, sterilize metal implements after each use like hospital-grade disinfectant. Second, disinfect foot basin after each use with bleach solution. Third, use boiling method for sterilization to disinfect all metal implement. Fourth, store sterilized metal implements in airtight and put it in a zipper sealed bag to keep them exposed from dirt and bacteria. And lastly, inspect tools and equipment regularly, identify defective tools that needs repair, replacement, or condemnation. Those are the ways to keep our equipment safe and functional. Now, how are we going to keep our area or salon clean and safe? There are nine ways to measure if our area is clean and safe. First, beauty salon must be well lighted, ventilated, and good sanitary condition. Second, premises must be free from rodents, vermin, flies, and or similar insects. Third, establishments must be provided with continuous running hot and cold water. Fourth, curtains and coverings in the salon must be washable and kept clean. Fifth, hair used cotton or other waste materials must be removed and deposited in a closed container. Six, restrooms must be well sanitized and be provided with individual towel. Seven, beautician must wear a washable uniform while serving clients. Eight, Client must be provided with a freshly laundered towel. And lastly, waste materials should be disposed in an enclosed waste bin and durable enough to resist tearing. Those are the ways in keeping our equipment safe and make our salon clean. Especially during this time of pandemic, we should keep it clean and be conscious on the things we use. Did you enjoy our topic this afternoon? Excellent! For your activity, open your module on page 19 and answer assessment 1 to 15. That's all for this afternoon. Remember, your nails are the reflection of yourself. If life gives you nail polish, make nail art. I hope you have learned something useful and relevant for your daily life. And of course, enjoy the topic. 
Once again, I am your teacher, Samantha Daniel Salvado Cruda of Nabunturan National Comprehensive High School, home of the Achievers, Nabunturan West District, saying, Dito sa TV Escuela, sa pag-aaral, sama-sama. Bye-bye!